everybody! Welcome to Gear Locked Reloaded. This is a self-imposed challenge where I will be progressing through increasingly powerful tiers of weapon and armor pieces. I've crafted three tiers for every region I will be selecting. Pieces within a tier can be collected in any order, but to advance to the next tier, I must collect every item from every region. The goal? Complete all the tiers doing content I've never done before. Now let's get started. And what better way to get started than hopping right into it? Let's go, I don't care what I look like. Bald man, just like me, hey -o! Congratulations, we've completed the task. The goal, the plan, the mission, the operation is we have to get through our first item. We need to get Kandarin unlocked ASAP. That way we can begin doing barbarian assaults so we can get our fighter torso nice and early. Otherwise, in tier one for Missilin, we have to get the granite boots, and in Karamja, we need the Obsidian Cape. So we are going to be trying our best to go ahead and level up as quickly as possible. Look at all these people! Congratulations, you have unlocked the Karamja area. Let's go into Relics. Relic selection, yes, yes, yes. I've done the previous Trailblazers League, let me through. Now, I've been doing some long, hard thinking about this. Which Relic do we go with? And that answer is Trickster. Why? Because I hate thieving. The Trickster Relic allows us to automatically repick it from our target. Pickpocketing is doubled. Coin pouch's limit, limit is multiplied by three. We get the Sage's Greaves, the Grant Agility XP while we're running. Then Box Traps get creatures faster. Loot Box, loot from Box Traps is doubled, yada yada. Burn nine logs simultaneously. Interesting, interesting. Main thing though, you cannot fail the actions for Thieving, Agility, Hunter, or Fire Making. We should have looked at the League's task list, but what we are going to do is we're going to pickpocket this man. Completing a task, pickpocket a citizen. And because we have Trickster, it just automatically pickpockets. Look at that, we're already level four. Level up, completed, level five. Oh, this is crazy. Absolutely crazy. So my plan right now is I want to do as much thieving as possible because I like thieving when I don't have to do anything about it. I think the goal is we need to get up to level 15. We're already level 10, so we are working hard and we are going at it. Ta-da! That's level 15. Oh, we're level 16 thieving. Why am I still over here? Well, let's go and tell the coin pouches empty out, you know? Oh no, somebody died. All right, that's all the coin pouches. Let's open them up. Open 28 coin pouches at once. That is a task. Interesting. Pickpocket a hand member. Let's go do that real quick. But first, let's talk to the cook. Oh, wow. The quest helper is already activated. Let's go. Let's also chop down a tree here. Just get a little axie axe action going on. Come on, bronze axe. You can do it. Chop down that tree. This is taking longer than I anticipated. You can't open while in combat. The mugger's attacking me though. We gotta show him what's up. Abandon ship, abandon ship. Go to pickpocket, go to pickpocket. Pickpocketing is the first goal for us. Why? I don't care. I don't know what anybody else is doing. I don't even know what I'm doing, okay? We are here to pick all the pockets, get all the things, pickpocket a hand member. Ooh, iron axes, raw anchovies. Achieve your first level 20. Ooh, we got the rusty swords. Those are actually really good. I need to keep those. You know, I'm so happy that they did this where they turned the, the clue scroll boxes into, into stackable pieces. Now I can just have a whole bunch of clues for when I'm ready. 30 thieving! Achieve the first level 30. Congratulations. I wonder how long it'll take to get to level 40. Probably too long. Let's go ahead. Let's abandon ship. Let's take a look at the task list. We're kind of near the Drain or Agility course, so let's go do that real quick. I wonder if you can get experience from the Sage's Greaves while running on top of the roof. You can. Interesting. We're going to be doing a lot of skilling to start off, but don't worry. We will get there. And with us climbing down here, we are officially at 25 agility with only 103 experience remaining. And that's completing 10 laps on the Draenor course. Now it's said that there's a mysterious tree in a potato field. Is this the mysterious tree in the potato field? I can't believe this is a task. There's a tree growing in a potato field and it's our mission to chop it down? Curious, very curious. I'll pick this potato. I have a potato and then I'm gonna eat it. You eat the potato, yuck. Potatoes aren't yucky, they're delicious. Now this is gonna take 20 million years because we're going, oh, never mind. Chop a log from a potato tree. Quest completed, cook's assistant. And that was 1500 cooking, which got us to level 11. Now, I'm going to be following someone's guide to get started. 
we did what we were doing in the initial phase. But now, let's get a little bit of a head jump by talking to Count Check over here. And let's just go to the stronghold of security. Let's get this out of the way. Let's get our 10k and our fancier boots. I have never taken so much damage while going through this area before. Ow, double ow. Go, go, go. Are you kidding me? I can't believe it. We died right at the boots. We might have to go back for those someday. Let's go visit Death's Domain. Let's see if we can get our 10k back. <laughs> we got our money back. Let's go. Easy trip back to Lumbridge. You can't use a steel axe until level six. I'm level five. I see. That's a predicament. Teleport to Mistalin. Take me back to Lumbridge Castle, baby. So I can literally buy one bronze axe. Wow, look at that. Chop some logs with a steel axe. A little weird because that definitely didn't use the steel axe. It used the bronze axe instead, but... I guess, I guess we can roll with that. We can rock, we can roll. Ooh, I need to fletch some arrow shafts. Let's do that. Oh, enter Xanaris. Let's go, let's actually do that. That's a, that's a task and the doohickey's like right over here. We have used a fairy ring and entered Xanaris. We have enough points to unlock a tier two relic. I repeat, a tier two relic. Let's meander on over to a bank. Fairy's Flight or Globetrotter? Fairy's Flight or Globetrotter? Fairy's Flight takes me to fairy rings, which are close to stuff. Globetrotter just gives me access to teleports earlier. Fudge it, we're taking Fairy's Flight. You've unlocked the Fairy's Flight relic. We have received the Fairy Mushroom. You can wield the Fairy Mushroom? Oh, that's cool. However, what are we doing now? What's on the goal? We have unlocked the relic. Now we need to complete 15 more tasks. Complete Gertrude's cat. That can be done. Complete the natural history quiz. That can also be done. Ooh, doggo, doggo, doggo alert, doggo alert. Pet the doggo. Huzzah. All right, I'm just going to be skilling for a little bit. I'll catch you all up when something exciting happens. But this is Leagues Day 1 on Gearlocked. The rush is real so that we can start getting all of our items. Pickpocket the guard completed. Now we sit back, we relax, and we get all of these level ups. Obtain 800 coins from coin pouches at once? That was a, that was a thingy? Let's go! Ooh, ooh, 55, 55. Now we just have to get Kandarin unlocked and we're gonna have a grand old thieving adventure. Don't ask why I've moved on. We got our 55 thieving, so now I just need to get Kandarin opened up, right? So now we're doing all the little tasks inside of Rock. We only got four left. Should be fine, right? Right? Yeah, it'll be fine. And then we're gonna give Elsie a little bit of tea so she'll tell us a story. Ooh la la. But more importantly, we can unlock our third area. Let's unlock Kandarin right now. Ooh. Oh, this is brilliant. This is beautiful. Look at us do the animation. Oh yeah. And you know what goes great with this? Our level 55 thieving, so we can go straight to Knights of Ardugne. Oh, this is glorious. Look at us thieving this Knight of Ardugne, not even knowing their pockets are getting picked relentlessly. Oh yeah, automatic pickpocketing is great. I love it. Everybody, we have now hit level 70 thieving. Achieve your first level 70, 80 points. But now this means we can move over to Paladins, which drop buco money and give us chaos runes. We have achieved our first level 80 and have unlocked enough points to get our third relic. Let's go. Do we have to go anywhere to do that? Let's just do that right now. Okay, so this is where it goes hard, right? Because we can pick Banker's Note or we can get Fire Sale. Fire Sale allows us to do anything with shops. What are shops that we require? None of our items that we need to get are going to be helped by shops that we can't do with the money we've already gained from thieving. So that's why I'm going Banker's Note, because this will allow us to note and unnote items anywhere in Gilinor, kind of like a bank, but you just don't have to be next to a bank. Let's go ahead, let's unlock it. Give me the thing, put it in my inventory. Ooh. Look at that banker's note. And we have the crystal of memories now, so we can actually do some teleportations. Let's go. 
Dude, I'm having a great time right now. Like, this AFK thieving is amazing. I know I will never get this in the main game. I don't want it in the main game. But for right now, watching number go up and I don't have to play the game, love it. Ooh, achieve your first level 90, 200 points. Wow. Ooh, we just achieved our first level 95 and got 200 points. Look at this. We're close to, we got 320 points until next relic. This is going great. I love this. We have officially hit 98 thieving. We are one level away from hitting 99, folks. We're going to get a 99 on day one. That was the plan from the beginning. Most definitely. We have 10 pickpockets left. This has been glorious. I have loved this grind. Doing all the pickpocketing, amazing. And now we are going to get our first 99 in Leagues for Trailblazers Reloaded. 99 thieving, let's go. Congratulations. We can now get the thieving cape if I had Asgarnia unlocked. But you know what, we'll worry about that in the future video. For now, we celebrate our achievement of getting a 99 on day one of leaks. Next video is gonna be all about them quests, baby. We gotta get Waterfall done, we gotta get Fight Arena done. We have all this money, we have all these runes, let's get our magic up. We gotta get some prayer up. We gotta actually train the account now, okay? We had our fun but we are doing all the things tomorrow.